Hey everyone, my name is Dan, I'm a veterinarian, and did your puppy dog just urinate some blood? All right, well there's two reasons for that that I see a lot. Let's go over it. So urinary bladder infections are really common. That's my number one. Bladder infection can cause blood in the urine because of all the irritation from the bacteria in the bladder. What you should do is go into your veterinarian and they'll get a urine sample. The urine sample will then allow them to see bacteria. So there's two things they can do. They can do a urinalysis and that's gonna scan for bacteria and you know what, they have some really, really, really fancy machines now. And they have, most of the veterinarians have them in house. So literally you can walk in there and get an answer before you even leave. And you can know if there's a UTI the same day and then you can get antibiotics the same day. So hopefully you're feeling better. The other thing they can do is they can do a urine culture, which takes a few days, but they can grow the bacteria and then tell your veterinarian which antibiotic to pick from, which is like gold standard and something that I highly encourage. Of course, both are great to start with and both will get you a urinary tract infection diagnosis. Okay, so number two is bladder stones. And bladder stones are super common. In our practice, we probably see them every other week. What your veterinarian will do is they will take an x-ray or do an ultrasound. And both those are great. It's good imaging. Those stones are full of minerals. And when they take an x-ray, they're gonna see the beautiful urinary bladder in the abdomen. And then they'll see either a nice big stone or a whole bunch of small stones. And they just pop out super easy. Every once in a while, you get a unicorn. And that stone won't show up. So you do an ultrasound and the ultrasound the belly and that stone will kind of glow and there'll be a shadow behind it and it's beautiful too. It's beautiful to me because we found the problem and we can fix the problem finally. Unfortunately, you know what I'm gonna say, it's surgical. Surgery is highly, highly encouraged for bladder stones. Of course, your veterinarian will decide what to do, but Going in there, taking the stone out, sending it off to a lab, getting it diagnosed, find out what kind of stone it is, and then prescribing the appropriate food. That way we stop bladder stones from forming in the future. In my opinion, is really good medicine. And that's what I would recommend doing. So if you see blood in the urine, you can kind of think, you know, it's gonna be these two things. Granted, there are a handful of other things it could be. But that's why you go see your veterinarian and they'll figure it out for you. I hope it made you a little more confident, a little less stressed. Make that appointment, get it figured out, and best of luck. And I hope you guys like and subscribe and check out some other videos. Thank you.